No, no. I'm the young. Sims is an idiot. He prides himself on his position as mayor and sheriff of this scrapyard. Oh, I see. I didn't realize Megaton had any guardian beyond its intrepid sheriff. Very well, then. I'll take my leave, as you suggested. If you need it, you spill it. Better him than me. of the glow for this ancient weapon of war what is our salvation it is the very symbol of Adam's glory yeah you need something good to see you I'll be damned you did it didn't you you disarmed that thing and all without asking for pay, too. Hell, why don't you move in? Here's the key and the deed to an empty house. Consider yourself a Megaton citizen. Oh, and talk with Moira at Craterside Supply. She's got random odds and ends you might be able to spruce the place up with. Here you're that stray from the vault. Oh, I haven't seen one of you for years. Good to meet you. I'm Moira Brown. I run Craterside Supply. But what I really do is mostly tinkering and research. Say, I'm working on a book about the wasteland. It'd be great to have the foreword by a vault dweller. Help me out, would you? I'm pretty sure I remember a girl coming into town with that about 10, 12 years ago. She didn't know a thing about the wastes, and I knew she'd get herself hurt without some sort of protection. So I offered to armor her vault suit. Never saw her again. Probably died out there, poor thing. In a way, she gave me the idea to write this book. It's yours if you help. 
great. <gasps> Just tell me what it's like to live underground all your life. Or, or to come outside for the first time. Or whatever strikes your fancy. <laughs> yeah, you wouldn't imagine how hard it is to replace that big light bulb up there, too. That's great for a forward. Open with a joke and all that. Here, take the suit. Something tells me you might need it. That'll be good for the book. In fact, want to help me with the research? I can pay you, and it'll be fun. Target? Whoa, no, no, no. It's not that sort of job. No, I'm talking about researching things, like surviving in the wastes and such. And I can offer caps and meds and a few of my inventions in return. I guess I can even get you some ammo, if that's more your style. Well, it's a dangerous place out there in the wastes, right? People could really use a compilation of good advice. Like a wasteland survival guide. For that, I need an assistant to test my theories. I wouldn't want anyone to get hurt because of a mistake. Nobody's ever happy when that happens. No, then they just yell a lot. At me. With mean, mean words. All right then. Now I think the first chapter will have to be about surviving day-to-day -day dangers. Things like where it is and isn't safe to find food, the dangers of radiation, and how to avoid and even profit from dangerous landmines. Ooh, sounds like fun, doesn't it? Which do you want to do first? Landmines are one of the few dangers out there that you can profit from. Disarm one before it blows, and you can sell it for plenty of caps. I've heard stories about a ghost town that's just full of mines. Traders just call the place Minefield. Sounds like the place for some field work. Get in there, get back, and tell me all about it. And could you bring back a mine for my studies? Oh, don't worry. No one ever goes there because they say it's a ghost town. And since ghosts don't exist, you can just focus on the landmines. I hear there's a playground in the middle of town. Reach that point and come back, and I'm sure you'll have some stories to tell. Good to see that old house finally found an owner. I have all sorts of items and themes for that place that may interest you. Sure thing. Good hunting. Purchase a... You can choose... Longing for the... Gr Remember, once you buy a theme, you can't sell it back to me. Well then... Good hunting! Don't try anything.